hello guys welcome back to salesforce anytime channel did you ever had a situation where you wanted to convert a salesforce 15 digit id into a salesforce 18 digit ids if yes uh, then this is the right video for you so i'm going to talk about how you can quickly convert uh, any salesforce 15 digit id into 18 digit id and also how you can convert multiple uh, salesforce 15 digit ids into 18 digit ids so let me show you that uh, let me log into pack magics uh, for that so i can show you how you can convert that so once i log in i will just navigate to um, the converter of uh, the 15 digit to 18 digit id converter so let me just type it in here 15 yeah so that should give me this menu so here i can enter uh, my 15 digit id and which should um, uh, display my 18 digit id once i click on convert to 18 digit ids so i actually did not receive directly any 15 digit ids uh, so i'm going to pretend that i have a sing, uh, 15 digit id already uh, actually i'm going to cut it out i took this backup of contact some time back so i'm actually taking the first 15 digits of this and i'm going to show you how it's going to generate the last three digits of that so this is my first uh, 15 digits of my salesforce id and once i click on convert to 18 digit ids it should convert yep so it, it has converted and added uh, the last three digits here so it's essentially uh, this is done and probably you should already know uh, for the systems uh, outside salesforce which are case insensitive so if they are using any comparison uh, for salesforce ids then uh, the comparison will happen case insensitive manner and in that case uh, it's very essential so that the the id stays unique uh, whether the case is being changed uh, on the first 15 digits so for that manner uh, salesforce has added last three digits as a checksum uh, digits um, and again there's a special logic for this you can search on google how the last three digits are generated but if you if you just quickly wanted to find it out then this is the way and again uh, if you wanted to find it out uh, from an excel if you got um, the like the 15 digit ids in a single row uh, single column sorry uh, then uh, you can actually convert the multiple ids uh, and you can upload it from csv here let me just show you there so i'm going to use browse button and i'm going to use this contact backup results which has around 20 uh, records and uh, in this case you, you want to select which ids uh, columns you wanted to convert so i'm going to select my first column to be converted so i'm going to just select that column which i want to convert and then i'm just going to click on map fields it's not going to immediately convert so it's going to bring it uh, to the screen so i'm just pretending i already had uh, 15 digit ids here so i'm just going to cut out the last three digits so you probably have 15 digits ids received from someone or received from a metadata api or somewhere which you have in excel sheet you can directly import here and uh, once you are imported here you should be able to convert them all so i'm going to show you only few examples i'm going to uh, just delete these so just wanted to show you how you can do uh, convert for multiple uh, ids at the same time so i have got around uh, eight ids to be converted i'm going to click on convert to 18 digit ids and it, sh it should convert all of them so you can see the triple a has been appended and depending on the the ids actually since these are very similar it has appended uh triple a at the end but depending on any id you enter 15 digit id it's going to convert it to the 18 digit id and then again you can download it as a csv and you can use it uh, for your reference whatever you want to do with it right you can use it um, in that way it will be easy for you to get the 18 digit ids 
um, in case you have any feedback comments about this conversion please do let me know uh, in the YouTube video or you can actually submit your feedback here help uh, feedback so thank you very much for watching this video I really appreciate your time please let me know if you have any feedbacks thanks bye